And in today's video, what I'd like to share with you is some information regarding changing from either Wix or Squarespace over to WordPress or maybe Duda or maybe even back. Maybe you want to go from WordPress to Wix or from WordPress to Squarespace or from Squarespace to Duda. Whatever the case is, that's the information that I want to give you and why this can drastically, drastically impact your SEO performance. So I don't want to waste too much time here. Let's get directly into it. First and foremost, I want you to know about DNS. Now you're already probably familiar about DNS, right? DNS sets things like your C name, right? Your C name records, also your A records, okay? And along with your DNS changing either C name, also A records, this is also where you're going to put in and change A records when you change over from say Squarespace to WordPress or from WordPress to Duda or whatever you're doing. You see, when you're on Squarespace, you are on Squarespace's hosting. So let's just say that we're on Squarespace. Here's our website. And this website here is five years old, all right? So when we have a five-year-old website and we are currently on Wix, and let's say that we want to update our website to WordPress, right? You want to update the website to WordPress. You want it to be faster. You want it to be a lot better. And that makes a lot of sense. The only issue that you're going to run into, maybe you're on Squarespace or maybe you're on Wix when you're going to WordPress, is that you actually need to change your DNS records, okay? When you change your DNS records, you change your IP address, okay? If we're going to change our IP address, this is like, let's say we're a brick and mortar business. This is identical to when we have a brick and mortar business, we've been in the same location for 10 years. The websites that have been coming, the billboards, the maybe you have TV commercial, maybe you've been sending out mail, customers have been coming there, they've been telling their friends. All of a sudden, your business address changes or your phone number changes, all your information changes. This can hurt the overall performance of your business, right? It's the same exact case when we're talking about a website. If I need to go in and I want to change for performance, you need to keep into consideration in your mind that if I'm changing from Wix to WordPress, yes, I'm getting a website boost, potentially a speed boost, maybe a design boost, but is that worth the fluctuation of changing your internet address and Google, in a lot of cases, dropping your website temporarily, but it could be months before it catches back up or maybe even perhaps starting that sandbox experience again where it takes months for Google to know who you are, what you do, where you're at, and if they trust you or not. I just wanted to put this video out because I was talking to a client this morning. I've talked to many clients that have gone through this. Hey, I was up on Wix or I was up on Squarespace. I changed my I changed it into WordPress or I changed to Duda and I saw a massive fluctuation. I was never able to regain my, my past, my past performance. I really don't want you to go through this. You know, I want you to really think about before you change your IP, before you change your website, right? Is those small updates worth a fluctuation within your business? If you're utilizing Squarespace, if you're utilizing Duda or if you're utilizing WordPress, whatever you're on, if you're going to change the DNS records, which is going to change the IP address, the digital location of where your website is hosted, think long and hard before you do it. Are those changes worth a fluctuation in your overall performance? If you're doing really well on Squarespace or Duda or on WordPress, before you change anything, Really, really think about changing your IP address because there is going to be a fluctuation before Google and other search engines will trust you. My name is Chris Palmer. If there's anything I could ever help you with, and I always look forward to seeing you in the next website SEO, switching from Wix to WordPress video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.